Right, who's on? Okay. All right. So, so we're with the lovely Tim Minchin, who's just come off stage, massively packed out tent. So yeah, thank you that, very much. That was good. Very good. Yeah, it's fun. So, actually, I've been to Reading now for 10 years, our 10th amazing year. But what is your best awesome. gig or performance in the last 10 years? Well, um, I've had a pretty fun time. I've had a ridiculously fun time. So, I suppose uh, um, Royal Out Hall this year with, with me orchestra was pretty amazing. Yeah. Sydney Opera House was pretty amazing just because it's my country and it's like playing the Sydney Opera House. And, but festival gigs are totally different, and I, and I like them because I just play them as gigs. I don't do all long because my my talky comedy is incredibly um, <laughs> uh, long and st stupid, and it doesn't work. I don't have lots of gigs, so I just play gigs, and it's fun. So these are these are like rock concerts, and everyone's very squealy, and it's like it's rowdy. Yeah, yeah. it's rowdy. And the thing is with my stuff is I'm kind of pretending to be a rock star and my audiences are kind of pretending to be the audience of a rock star and we're all sort of in on the joke but in the end it still feels like a rock concert, it's good. Cool. It's good. So, so I don't know, they're all good. I, like, I, like, I, I think like, those two are pretty, pretty out there. Yeah, yeah. I mean other holes, uh, you just kind of go, oh shit. Oh, O2 is pretty amazing too. Big, gig, big gigs are amazing because you feel uh, you can't believe you're doing them. Yeah. They're also, they're not the best gigs artistically. Because you don't really know, you just, it's just, just that. Yeah. It's just that. Mm. What's your favourite gig? Last my favourite gig? This one, just now. Yeah. yeah. Of course. Of course. Of course. <laughs> Scrape through with that question. <laughs> um, and Action Aid have been going, achieving amazing things, campaigning, HIV, hunger. Is it going well? It's going good. Well, we're sitting here with you. You haven't fixed it though, have you? No, we're trying. No. Can you Can help you us? Fix it? Everyone's like, oh, we're going to fix it. They don't fix it. It's, no. it's, we're working to. Working on it. Um, what would you say? <laughs> you want to get everyone to the point where uh, where they can bitch about being relatively poor, but their basic needs are met. It's human nature for people to feel poor, yes. even, even regardless to this relative poverty. Just like everyone's going, poor rioters, they're poor, and you're like, yeah, except for their showers and their food and their clean water and their tellies and their mobile phones. But it doesn't matter because it's relative. But if you can get everyone so they're not dying of it, then we're good. Yeah. Yeah. Should we do that? Can we do it together, us three? Okay. Yeah. Gonna... Preferably on a Tuesday afternoon. I'm busy. I've got to wash my um, face, Tuesday. I'm actually free. So you can do it if you want. We'll do it. And you join us on Tuesday evening. Yeah. We'll get it done by nine and have a drink. Done. Okay. I think that's easy. easy. And a sandwich. Sorted. That's a sandwich. Ooh, yes. We love sandwiches, us. <laughs> <laughs> Sandwiching right now. Right? Can you just so. say bollocks to poverty? Bollocks to poverty. <laughs> bollocks. Done. <laughs> Lovely. Bollocks. 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 Bolloc